Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. The following is a championship first round match. Making his way to the ring from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, the The WWE Universe standing in reverence. No one embodies human suffering and inescapable peril more. Yeah, this isn't make-believe. It's like having real horror among us. A being who wields unspeakable power and transcends space and time. A dark fog envelops our arena. And the creatures of the night are upon us. Entering the hollowed ground of WWE's Hall of Fame just made the Phenom stronger. Think of the incredible resume of The Undertaker. Won the Royal Rumble, conquered Hell in a Cell, and won 21 consecutive WrestleMania matches. Arguably the most incredible competitor in WWE history, and the decades of destruction continue. The wrath of the Reaper annihilates your body and your soul. Impossible to prepare for, unfeasible to predict. Every step the Phenom takes, you're one step closer to your demise. It is a grave mistake to assume that you will survive. From out of the shadows, Uncle Howdy is here. A being who seems to dwell in the darkest parts of our minds. Might be a spirit, maybe an alter ego, perhaps an evil twin. The truth is, we just don't know. Looking at the face of Uncle Howdy, it is truly a frightening sight. That's right. Just that creepy mask alone. And I shudder to think of the pure evil lingering under that mask. Yeah, you're not the only one, Saxton. These are the ultimate mind games being played by Uncle Howdy. We've seen Uncle Howdy's attacks have devastating consequences, but what happens when he steps inside the ring to actually compete? Well, Byron, we're about to find out, and I've got an ominous feeling it's gonna be horrifying.
Serious implications in this contest. The winner advances in the tournament. Loser has to head back to the locker room. Ousted from the event moving forward. Wrist lock applied. Oh, man, look at this power. Ooh. Evading offense. Superstars. While it certainly can be a factor, I don't think it should be a concern. The only thing you should be concerned about is getting wet. Of all the toys underneath the ring, he just had to go with the one that ensures splinters. Boom! Oh, just one right after the other can't be stopped. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. Well scattered reversal there. Uh-oh. And he was ready for Undertaker. Oh, nothing fancy with that boot. He's turning the tables. Precisely measured attack. Stiff headbutt. Undertaker counters. Caught with the lariat. What impact! Right in the kisser. Oh, and he said, You're not getting me with that this time. Thrown back in under the ropes. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. His opponent, no respect is earned, and he's still a dollar short. Taking it outside the ring now. Oh, someone's got to stop this. Undertaker unleashing such devastation. Taker is digging another hole. And they're returning to ringside action. That's a rare sight. And now out into the WWE Universe. Ooh, this is absolute bedlam right now. Growling in the crowd amongst the unwashed masses. This is only going to get worse. Ooh, oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Ooh, back elbow puts a stop to things. Oh, and an uppercut by the off the tooth. Maybe they should think about taking the fight somewhere else. There you have Saxton. Thinking's not really on the menu right now. And some effective offense with that one. And they are out in the throngs of the WWE Universe itself. Someone get 
get security out there. about to end another fight. time in the world. He's doing some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. Uh-oh, cleared up the announce table. Uh, this is about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty. I don't want to see this happen. Oh, this is going to hurt. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. Oh, nice. His offense is on point right now. He's hitting on all cylinders right now. Looks like he has something planned with this table, guys. I don't want to know. Boom, what a punch. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just going to step aside now. Hey, wait for me. And he gets set back into the ring. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. He's able to fend up. Undertaker had that. Superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's going to find a way to capitalize on that vulnerability? Okay, he's re entering the ring. He got whipped into that corner. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Into the ring. Straight impact on the throat. Uh oh. Boom! Scorpion death drop. And the pressure being put on the phenom there. When you're in a tournament situation, Cole, you tend to push yourself to your limits. This deep into the match, and he's able to kick out before a look out. It's stunning. Trap. Endless knee strikes. He's one step ahead there. Kendo stick impact. Knew what was coming from Taker. Boom! Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Ooh, nasty shot to the throat. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. Bringing a steel chair into play here. He's making his intentions known to everyone in the arena. Planted with a neck breaker. Oh. 
setting up the table. He is done playing around. Indeed! Looking for the victory! Are you kidding me? Not even a one count. Agreed, Saxton. Looks like there's no limit to how much damage this superstar can absorb. It must be demoralizing knowing you've unleashed your best shot on your opponent to no avail. We've got to acknowledge these fans. A packed arena, and we're hearing every single voice. It is loud, and it is mad in here. And that was some vicious DDT we just saw. He's setting this table up, and guys, oh no, are they setting the table on fire? This is too damn fun. Scoop slam. The dead man has decided this ends now. Crashing through the table. That was too much. Dangerous ideas and bad intentions becoming reality. There's no room for hesitation when you're dealing with flaming furniture. I'm feeling a titanic ship roaring through this crowd right now. Well, you're not the only one, Saxon. It's all coming to a head. The Undertaker with a vintage boomstone. Wait a minute. Darkness has just enveloped this entire arena. I, I can't see a thing, guys. Ouch. Chair in hand. Intentions in mind. And he's taking this to the outside now. Oh, clobbered by the steps. That'll make you reassess some things. Still bad butt. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Reversal by the Undertaker. the WWE Universe, this place is starting to rock. And he goes into the ring. Coming back in the ring. Good night. He avoids the damage. Way to steer clear. Brutality. Well placed knee, and another, and another. Thunderous shot to the back. Shades of the USSR with the hammer and sickle. Looking for something, anything under the ring. He grabbed the chair. Soaring. He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? And he only stays down for a one count. We are this far into the match. Where is the... Oh. He's retired this moment, dude. The Undertaker grows with this emphatic victory by the Phenom.